We want to integrate everything because the way science kind of happens in real life, it's not segmented into these little bits. We want to show how all those different strands of sciences are connected. We've taken the approach of a storyline and the story that we're telling in seventh grade science this year is kind of a stretch from what we've done in the past. It's this idea that earth systems are starting to fail. Our environment is collapsing. We look at the science behind the atmospheric you know, climate change and, and all these problems that we're having on, in the water and on land. And we come to the conclusion that the best way to resolve the problem is by traveling to Mars and colonizing a new planet. And so we look at all the space sciences involved in that. So we've got some, some robots that students are learning how to code and program and all those different uh, planetary sciences involved in landing on Mars. Students are programming and coding and designing the robots so that they can achieve these different challenges. I think the, the real idea that we wanted to convey was that the different strands of science, the chemistry and the biology, these, are, these don't exist in isolation of each other, right? And so if a student finishes one unit in chemistry, they might not see it again for a long time. So using an integrated model, we're seeing how these ideas continue to evolve and grow and complement each other. Also using a story like traveling to Mars is pretty compelling. It really keeps the kids hooked on what's going on in terms of the, the science associated with it. That was so fun, absolutely. I mean, the, the classroom has turned into a little embodiment of Mars. Uh, we've got planets, we have astronauts on the ceiling, um, aliens over in the corner. Um, but aside from the sci the, that science fiction side of it, uh, I, I love teaching in this way. Um, and I think, you know, people are compelled to follow a story and as a teacher, I'm sort of compelled to tell a story too. So it's, uh, it's nice for both sides.